Hello pianist, I'm so glad that you're joining me today for the B flat or A sharp major arpeggio. We have some things to share with you. The fingerings are very interesting. I think you're gonna enjoy it. So if you'll come on and join me here at the keys, we're gonna take a look. So if you will remember the B flat major chord, if we just block that out for a moment, is B flat, D and F. So those are the three notes that we're gonna be focusing on for this broken chord or arpeggio. Right hand, you're gonna start on a four here, and you'll follow the same finger pattern as what we've shown you on A flat and D flat and E flat, it's the same finger pattern. So let's go over that, starting with the fourth finger on B flat. Right hand, turn under here to the D, that opens the hand to F, and again, the four on the B flat. You can, of course, roll that forward up another octave, as many as you would like. Typically, we do two octaves here. There's my four descending. I just walk down the two to F, thumb on D, big cross here, four to B flat, second finger. Here's my D with the thumb and crossing over to the B flat, fourth finger. Okay, so the left hand provides us with a little bit of a different view here. Same three notes, same B flat, D, and F, but we're gonna approach it differently. Instead of using the two, one, four, two pattern that's been typical so far. We notice that this chord is structured so that there's two white keys on the end here. So we have a black key, a white key, not another black key, so it's not a true V-shaped chord there. We have two white keys on the end. So the left hand is traditionally played where you have a B-flat third finger, second finger D, and thumb on F. Yes, that's three, two, one. Roll over the three for the second octave, two, one, cross, reach up there to that B flat, thumb behind there on the F, D, B flat, rolling out the wrist and the elbow to reach that F with the thumb, and walk it home. So those of you that remember the B-flat scale, you may recall that the B-flat major scale or the A-sharp major scale begins with a three in the B-flat. Beginning left hand finger number is a three. So it's kind of interesting to notice that on the arpeggio, the starting fingers for the B-flat arpeggio is three in the left hand, four in the right hand. The same exact starting fingers that you have for the scale. So that might be one way to help you remember this oddity, if you want to call it that, of fingering. Okay, now putting your hands together, we're gonna to walk through this if you'd like to join me. Here we go, three in the left hand, four in the right. Ready and play. B flat, turn the right hand, D, there's your thumb. F, turn the left hand, here's your three in the B flat, four in the right. Right hand thumb turns, D. Here's my F natural. Make sure you match up, three in the left, four in the right. Stepping down, left hand U, come behind for the F, walking to the D, right hand cross over, four to that B flat, F, there's your thumb in the left hand, and we should finally end, same fingers we started. Okay, that concludes the B flat or A sharp major arpeggio. Thank you so much for joining me. I'm so proud of you for working on these black key arpeggios. I know they're tricky. Hang in there. I believe in you. You're gonna do a great job.